okay, how to borrow Kindle books from your library. So I'm going to walk you through how this works. Um, the first thing you need to do is find your library. So go to overdrive.com, um, and hopefully your uh, library is connected to Overdrive. Uh, and basically what you need to do is you're going to essentially connect your library online account to Overdrive. Okay? So now once you do that, you see I'm already logged in with my county library on Overdrive. They have their own kind of web page of what's available. You can see I can search. Uh, I can have I have an account. And basically it shows you, you know, some, some books that are available, um, audio and digitally. I'm going to search for Dan Brown. I'm just going to go through an author just to show you how they pop up. So it shows you, you know, I can place a hold or, or, or I can borrow. I'm also going to select ebooks to filter just the ebooks because it'll show me a bunch of stuff. I decide I'm going to borrow a book. All I need to do is click borrow or click on the book. You'll see I, it, you know, there's some info about it. I can read a sample. It gives me the options to borrow for 21 days or 7 or 14 days. And from this point, I can just click to borrow it. And then what it's going to actually do is kind of take me to uh, my loans page. It gives me that option there. And I'm going to check out. So this whole thing, there's like a whole bunch of steps, right? So I've, I said, this is what I want to borrow. I'm going to go to my account. You see loans, which is like similar to like my, my shopping cart. It shows me what I have out. And then I have a couple options here. So this is the one I want to check out. I can read it right now. I can download it as a... EPUB book, or I can uh, read it with Kindle. So I want to show Kindle. So if I click on this, it then takes me to my Amazon account. Okay. So once I decide to finally click on this, it's going to take me to Amazon. Okay. Uh, I'm not logged in. So if I go to click uh, to check this book out on the far right, it's going to take me to the login page, I'll log in and my Kindle is, you know, linked to my account. So now when I go here, I have the option to send it to my Kindle or any other device I have that's linked. In this case, I want to send it to my Kindle. And I'm going to go ahead and select that and it's going to get sent. Now, when I go to my Kindle, you'll see, I'm going to show in one second here. Okay, I start this up and you can see instantly once it, there it is. It's already, it's queued. I'm going to select it. I said, do you want to download now? I say, yes, so as long as I'm on the internet, that's going to pop up right away. It gets sent. It's downloaded. It takes just a second or two. Now I see uh, the book. I can click on it and I can start reading it. When it gets done, basically once it, it'll, it'll just uh, get returned on its own and it won't let you access it anymore. But uh, pretty simple. Hope this helps and good luck.